Well, the city of Wyandotte is getting ready for another farmer's market next Friday. It provides fresh foods to visitors. And joining me this morning is Kelsey Hatley of the Wyandotte Farmer's Market. We're so happy you're here. Everyone loves a farmer's market, yes. right? Yeah, I especially do. Absolutely. <laughs> so you brought some stuff here yeah. and it's uh, some out of the ordinary things you might not be used to finding at the farmer's market. And what do we have here? Uh, this is roasted lentils by Simple Supple Foods. They're based out of Ferndale, Michigan. So um, we've got the standard blend, the Mediterranean and the spicy. You I'm going to try some of these. Them. These are really good. Mm -hmm. And tell me about the health benefits of these because they're kind of a strange little thing. Yeah, Lentils uh, are a great source of protein, high in fiber and they're good for your heart too. These are good on salads, mm -hmm. soup, Pumice. Oh, roasted veggies. Yeah. Really good. Everything, yeah. It's really tasty too. Mm -hmm. A good snack. And, and they're gluten free, I believe, yes. too, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So, some body stuff. I love getting this kind of local, homemade mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah, it's really cool. It's all natural and, uh, you know, natural ingredients. And um, what is this? Um, this one is a coconut turmeric uh, cocoa. And then we have a body scrub and some raw anti accident chia jam. All right, and so the cool. name of the company is? Apotha Kitchen. All right, and what does that come from? Does he make it in his kitchen? Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, it's a natural natural kitchen. How so. fun. Mm -hmm. And here we have some chutney. Yes. Uh, bee leaf is local Michigan made, uh, all natural uh, salsa type uh, jam kind of thing. We love so. the, the local products. And now this, before I drop this, mm -hmm. looks like a tiny popcorn. Yeah, it's a low calorie alternative for popcorn. It's uh, sorghum, popped sorghum. I like stop moving everything mm -hmm. and eating it. <laughs> okay, so what is it? Uh, it's sorghum, so it's... I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's a... Uh, is it like a seed? Mm -hmm, kind of. Okay. Yeah. And this is very spicy, but very good. Yeah, a good alternative. Mm -hmm. We have some beautiful vegetables. I even asked you if this was fake because it looks so colorful. No, it's all real. Tell yeah. me what's in season right now. Uh, there's strawberries if you want some fruits, but also uh, carrots, radishes, and green Just peppers, beautiful. kale. Yeah. All fantastic things. And how often does the farmer's market happen? We do once a month, the first Friday of every month. It's from 12 to 6 on the corner of 1st and Elm Street in Wyandotte. You can see it all right there, the Farmer's Market. Again, the first Friday of every month and now through October. And it starts at noon, runs through 6 p.m. And then we also have the Vintage Market. That's every third Friday of the month now through October, 3 in the afternoon until 10 p.m. So tell me about the Vintage Market. Uh, that we partnered with a local business in Winda. It's uh, the Vintage Home Market. And they do a pop-up uh, outdoor Vintage Market. For us. So a lot of cool vendors and really neat stuff. What kind of stuff can we find there? Uh, vintage clothes, vintage oh, furniture, cool. stuff like that. Yeah. All right. Cool. Fantastic. Thanks so much Thank for you. joining us and bringing yes. all this cool local stuff. Some fresh fruits and veggies. We'll be right back with our latest news update right after the break.